Hi, uh, this is going to be a short video because I need to teach soon. Uh, first of all, thank you for all your retweets and comments on Facebook and your emails of support and mentions on blogs. Um, it's all very much appreciated. Thank you. Um, I recently read an article about setting goals and uh, this was by Arena Nekitina and it was about SMART goal setting. Now SMART is an acronym S-M-A-R-T and I wanted to share that with you and to talk about how that applies to my thousand challenge. So the first one, S, is specific. The goal needs to be specific. When you're learning a language you can't just say, I want to improve my English or I want to improve my Spanish. We need a specific goal of, for example, in this case, I want to learn or memorize a thousand words and phrases. Uh, that is a specific goal and I know when I have reached the end of it. Uh, that brings me on to measurable, M, measurable. Uh, the goal needs to be measurable. We need to know when we have arrived at the end of the goal. We need to achieve the goal uh, or we lose motivation. And I will know that I have finished and I will know that I have achieved my goal when I have learned a thousand words or phrases. Uh, or not, depending on how things go on July the 1st. Um, a, so we've done S, specific, M, measurable, A, attainable. Uh, the goal needs to be attainable. And uh, added to that, R, the fourth one, R, the, needs to be realistic. Um, <clears throat> now, is my goal of uh, 1,000 words and phrases in one month attainable, realistic? Um, I hope so. I think so. We will see in two weeks. Um, but you have to you have to decide for yourself what your uh, what is reason a reasonable goal for you. Uh, I can't do two thousand words in one month or three thousand words, and you can't say learn a whole language in three months. That's just not possible. Um, but you, if you set yourself reasonable, attainable goals, then when you achieve them, you, you feel a lot better. And when you, once you've finished achieving that one, you feel more motivated to set another goal and to start again and to improve even further. Um, finally, timely. You need to have a deadline for your goal. Uh, you need to have a specific uh, period of time that you are going to work on this goal. Uh, improving your English or improving my Spanish is something I will do through my whole life, but for these goals I need to set a time and in this case uh, I've set a month. So I've certainly got a deadline and a time limit which helps me with my motivation. This is not something which continues again over and over and over and I cannot see the end of it. Uh, this will be finished in two weeks. Maybe I will set another goal after that, but this goal, this challenge, um, this objective is for the month of June, and then I'll be finished. Anyway, I um, wanted to say thank you very much again for all of your support, and I will see you later.